Hey everybody, it's Steve from B&H Photo and we're at NAB in 2015. I'm talking with Gary Mandel from Sony and we're talking monitors, 4K OLED monitors. Gary, thanks for talking with us. Yeah, thank you for coming. So now these are two of the same monitors, but they look a little bit different. What's going on? There's quite a bit of difference. These are two of our new BVM X300 4K OLEDs. Um, they're using our TriMaster EL technology, um, but what's really special about these is it's a new panel design and a whole new monitor design. You were saying, I mean, this is nice. This is a lot more vivid. What's going on? This is much different, isn't it? What's going on is we've been looking at content usually set between zero and 100 nits normally. That's what everything is authored at. It has been for, for years and years and years. So no matter how bright my monitor, the content's authored at 100 nits. Is, right, exactly. So what's happened is we now have these TVs that can go much brighter, but we're not making any use of them. So what we're offering here in HDR is to make use of that extra brightness and that extra range. The content here has been authored, one for standard dynamic range and one in high dynamic range. And what we're doing here is the monitor can get brighter, but also the way the light is scaled out of the monitor is different. So the bit level into the monitor is transferred differently to the light level out. Than you'd have with a standard monitor with a fluorescent backlight. Correct. So what we're doing is we're, be, we're able to show highlights and um, speculars in the image at a much more realistic level. And it, it gives you a much larger impact. And we can take this and we'll give this to the artist to uh, develop the story more and to give more information out to the viewer uh, to convey uh, the emotion. Now the OLED, that's, that's one of the secrets behind it. What else is going on with the HDR and not to be confused with still photo HDR? Okay, in, yes. Um, in still photo HDR, it's not the double exposure or uh, anything like that. This is a straight, we call it an EOTF, electrical optical transfer function. And it is the ratio of the data to the pixel light level. So at this bit level comes out this amount of light. And that's different than it is in normal uh, television. Here, because this display will go to a thousand nits, in ten times of what we're showing here, um, we can take these areas, and you can see the color and the brightness out of them. It's much more vivid. If uh, you look in some of the areas, we have a fire. The flame looks real because there's more information, where there's more scaling in the light. You really out. get some of the orange highlights in that right. fire, which we're here. losing there. Yeah, you can see here the blues versus the blacks and the, and the detail. It's pretty exciting technology. It's very exciting. Um, this has been a real uh, eye-opener to a lot of our customers. This, we've been showing images here that a lot of people have said uh, they've never seen before, just I, to the level of quality. I can completely believe it. It's really beautiful. Gary, thanks for spending time with us today, and thanks for watching.